Hey guys, it's Regent here and today I will show you how to build a string duper or a string farm in Minecraft. Have fun! First, as always, the material list. We start by looking north or west. Then place 6 blocks like I did in the video. Next we build everything 2 blocks higher. Here we place 3 temporary blocks and on the inside we place 2 trapdoors. Remove the 2 temporary blocks. Next we place water in the trapdoors. Then we take the tripwire hooks and place them on this spot. Now place a construction block on top of it and in front of it a lever. If you activate the lever now, the direction of the water should change like in the video. Next we take strings and place them between the tripwire hooks so we get a line like in the video. Now we stand up right here and have to be quick. Take down the string with a shear and activate the lever immediately afterwards. If you do that right, the duper will start to duplicate. By the way, it took me also several times to get the system running, so don't be worried if it doesn't work with the first try. So the duper is already working. The farm will also continue to run even if you restart the server. To stop the duper, you just have to toggle the lever. And don't worry, after that you can switch it back on with just uh, using the lever again at any time without any problems. And again, very important, the direction must be north or west. In the direction of south and east, the farm will not work. Next, we build a small storage system. You can build it as big as you like. First, follow the steps from the video. I use glass here, but you can use any kind of building block you want. When you have that ready, you can place a row of double chests right here. In front of that comes a row of hoppers which lead into the chests. Above the chest is a row of glass, which prevents the items from flying out and the water from remaining in the system. Here you also have to use glass, otherwise the crates can't be opened. To be on the safe side, you can build another row of glass on top of this one, so you're making 100% sure that no items will get lost. Finally, you place water right here, and then you can see how far the system goes. 
Of course, you can now adjust it to your needs, so either build it a little bigger or a little smaller. Now we can turn on the farm and you see the strings arrive in the boxes. Of course, you can now close everything if you want or build a roof or make it just looking better. That's it again with the video, I hope you liked it and if you did, please subscribe and like it. Ciao!